Now over here at my enchanting table, I've enchanted a lot of stuff. I've enchanted my swords and my tools and my armor because the place I'm about to take you is potentially the most hostile place I've been yet. So hold on to your hats. Hey everybody. I'm deep down inside the Devil's River mine. It's a two-level mine shaft. Down the staircase is the lower level. It's a pretty big mine. But I think I've about mined it out. I've removed a lot of gold and iron and coal. Emeralds. It's been quite the experience. But I'm closing this mine down. And I may never come down here ever again. So I'm just checking it out. Kind of showing it to you guys. And now we leave it, possibly forever. Now I've done a lot of mining here at Devil's River. And what I just showed you was the main mine. I've made lots of little mine shafts, you know. The mining has been very good here. But I feel like I've been here for months and months. And it's time to move on. Here's the main living area. Let's step outside and get a breath of fresh air. Judging by the sky, it appears that the sun is going down. And Devil's River is not a good place to be when the sun goes down. Now across that meadow is a mountain. And underneath that mountain is my new mine. The mine I call the Lava Camp Mine. There's my chickens. And on the other side of that wall is the Devil's River. Let's jump in. And now I feel fresh and ready to go. Now over here at my enchanting table, I've enchanted a lot of stuff. I've enchanted my swords and my tools and my armor because the place I'm about to take you is potentially the most hostile place I've been yet. So hold on to your hats.
I'm going to suit up, put on my helmet and my breastplate. Yeah, this, this armor is enchanted, ready to go. And I have a feeling I'm going to need that. Let's put this lapis lazuli back. Here's my iron chest. There's like over 3,000 bars of iron there. There's about a thousand bars of gold and over, I don't know, 300 diamonds, a few emeralds. Mining has been very good here. And I almost hate to leave it. But I opened up a new mine and it's called the Lava Camp Mine Shaft. And that's where we're going to go right now. So now we're leaving the Devil's River Mining Outpost. To the right, that takes us to the snow base. And... This sign points us to the lava camp mine shaft. And it's way down there. So we're going to go down to level 12 because it's my understanding that is where most of the diamonds can be found. So now we're on level 12, and when we look back, we can see just how far down we came. This is the main mine shaft. Eventually there will be a lot of tentacles to this mine shaft, lots of little smaller mine shafts. As of right now, there's only a few, and they're on the other end of this one. Now, while I was mining down here, I stumbled across something that I've never seen before. And it's kind of uh, frightening looking, kind of hair raising, terrifying. And right then and there, I decided to stop what I was doing and wait until you guys could be with me before I went any further. All I've done was mark the path and it's down this mine shaft. And I've got torches that will take us to that point. But first, let's check out the, the lava camp. And it's because of the lava that's in this room and that's where it gets its name. I've got some smelting going on. So let's get the spoils of my mining efforts out of the ovens. Mining has been very good, very good down here at the lava camp. I've only made a few shafts but I've drawn out a lot of uh, commodities here. A lot of coal. It's kind of a mixture of a lot of different things. I 
let's get the last little bit of this iron. I hope you're ready for this. down this way and up those steps and we're going to put some some proper stairs Now one of my one of my Patreons told me I was probably one of the luckiest Minecrafters he'd ever seen because of the place that I originally spawned seems to be a really good spot. But the other reason is uh, I've sp I've stumbled across something that apparently is quite rare. And that is what is known as a stronghold. Now, I have not entered the stronghold yet. All I've done was place a few torches in this room to light it up and to wall off the monsters. And you can hear them. There's a cave down there. But I wasn't sure if the monsters could come out, so I built this wall to kind of keep them down there. And I'm going to have to build a bridge to get over there to the stronghold. When I first saw that, I was like, what? is that and I'm kind of hesitant to go in there but I'm excited at the same time I don't have any more blocks Normally I carry a stack of cobblestone, but I'm going to have to mine some before we proceed. Let's make a window here. Yeah, there, he's right on the other side of the wall. Let's take him out by the legs. I think I knocked him right off the ledge. There's a skeleton. Knocked him off the ledge.
I'll eventually go down there and clear that cave. But in this video, we're going to explore this stronghold. I've never seen one of these. And there's a good chance that a lot of you have never seen one either. I'm kind of thinking how I want to do this. I'm going to put some stairs. Some people wouldn't waste time putting stairs, but that's, that's just me. I need to get rid of some of that above me. Hold on to your hats. Here we go. Now, I'm a very analytical type person, so bear with me as I formulate a plan in my mind on how to best go about checking out this dark, dank, subterranean, dungeon-looking place. Now, the definition of a stronghold is a, well, one definition is a fortified building. It's fortified so that it can withstand attacks based on the look of this place so far. It doesn't look like it withstood very well. I imagine the monsters overran this place eons ago. Probably killed all of the citizens, all of the occupants of this stronghold. That mossy uh, stone floor is wild. It's just a single room. Oh, that looks spine chilling. Like I can feel the the hair standing up on the back of my neck. There's a skeleton. I'm gonna take out my bow. Let's see if I can't place a shot right where it counts. This 
sneak up on him. My arm's getting tired of holding this bow. I'm going to have to let it go. Get my arrow back. And one last look. I wonder if I could get across there. I can't believe I did not mine enough cobblestone. I can't even build a simple bridge. We're going to have to get some more. We cannot go Galahad around inside this stronghold without the proper supplies. Plenty of cobblestone is one of the essential things that you should have in your inventory. Curious to know how many of you Minecraft players have discovered a stronghold. I'm also curious to know how many of you have not ever discovered one of these strongholds. It's one of those silver fish. Those things are a nuisance. So now you know why we enchanted our armor, our diamond armor. This place is going to be so hostile. And so petrifying. Look at that, it's so dark. It's... And I hear zombies. I'm really not sure what to do, which way to go. Look at these iron bars. Looks like some kind of some kind of prison. Some kind of place to lock people up. It's definitely a monster on the other side of that wall. It's like, what is kind of sick, twisted, insane asylum is this? What did they have locked up in there? It's like we're in Frankenstein's castle down in his dungeon underneath. I 
Let's look in here. Yeah. One last hit. Talk about a great place to be just murdered, which is what he's trying to do to me right now. The only guy can get lost down here. We must be cautious. We must be careful. I have not died in this game since I fell prey to the spider spawner. Some of you remember that, where I was stuck in the spider webs right above the spawner. I go down in there. I'll save that for later. Let me fix the floor. I'm surprised we don't see blood just smeared all over the walls. There's no telling what kind of what kind of war went down inside this place. Well, it's pretty obvious the monsters won. You know what? What? Look at that's. Look at all those books. This is like a a mammoth library. I'm not sure what the point of it is. It's one of the coolest things I've seen since I've played this game. I'll get the spider webs out of here. I want to take these books with me. I want these books back at my main castle. Wait, look at 
That's it. There's it. What? That's one of those silver fish. Block him off. He did not see me. I hope I don't run into him again. Yeah, I've got to, I have to take these. Talk about a treasure. Hey, there's a treasure chest. Lots of paper and a few books. I am going to have more than a few books once everything is said and done. I'll eventually have to go down there. But for right now, let's just clean this place up a little. Yes, very, very unusual, very strange. Horrifyingly strange. All the knowledge that lays within these books and the inhabitants couldn't use it to defend their stronghold against the monsters. Uh oh, spiral staircase. Man, someone is down there. A zombie is down there doing God knows what. He doesn't seem to be bothered by an arrow in his forehead. It's like he didn't know I was here. It's like he's down here stoned or something. You know, people that hang out at the bottom of stairwells like this are usually up to no good. is so cool. But let's go through here. See what lies around the next corner. We want to go in there. Jeez, that's unnerving back there. Look at how dark it is. Oh, that's not too bad. I thought it was a big cave. What to do, what to do. I 
I'm just going to start destroying these doors, putting them in my inventory. Not sure where to go. I'm trying to remember where I've been and where I have not. Okay, we just came from there. It was a great big fountain, kind of like at the mall. That's what this place reminds me of, uh, an abandoned mall from the 70s that nobody uses anymore. And it's fell into disrepair. You can go on YouTube and see videos of people exploring abandoned malls. Sometimes the, the electricity is still on at the, at the mall, but it's, but it's abandoned and it's pretty, pretty crazy stuff. monsters. They look like they're trapped and can't get to me. Oh, I take that back. One of them is getting to me. I don't think I want to go down there. What's down here? I don't think this is part of the stronghold. Now there's some torches. So uh, apparently I've I've been in here before. or at least to the point where the torches were.
you can never have too many torches. Where exactly are we? Let's find our way back to the stronghold. Okay. Boy, that's creepy. I feel like I'm about to be jumped any second. There's a skeleton. Lava. So far, so good. What was that? Was that a big spider? Let's get ready to plant one. Come on, my arm got tired. Can't sit there and hold a, pull a bow back all day. Oh, oh. that's just hacking the death of this sword. Oh, I better eat something.
gosh, where'd he come from? It's a good thing I've got this armor on. way Last thing I want to do is fall. So. Oh no, oh, 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 things are fixing to get dicey. Very dicey. Where's that creeper? Where is that creeper? That subterranean devil. That menace I thought I saw a creeper or did I imagine that I think he's right around the corner. There he is. Oh, oh, oh. Oh no. Silverfish.
you can tell the silverfish are in the blocks. When you get close to them, you can hear them. My senses are on overdrive right now. There's dinner. chest. What's inside? What's inside? What's inside the chest? There's a spider. Now let's look in the chest. A little bit of gold. Gotta get rid of something to get something. Nice new pair of pants. More of those twisted Ages. What in God's name did they keep in there? Maybe this is like some some laboratory. Another spider. The spiders don't seem to be very aggressive. Uh, there's, there's a party going on. There is a party going on in there. A 
I'm not sure how many were in there. Let's run down here. Look in this door. Skeleton. So that is probably one big room. Two against one. See what we can do with this guy. He has been dispatched. Let's look down into this hole to hell that he came out of. He just, he just fell. What's, okay. It's a pretty good ways down. Did that fall kill the creeper? Or did he just land and go about his merry way? Bag of bones. Need to have a look up here. Or at least we can see what's in that room below. That was kind of disappointing. Oh, oh, 
And outside my window there's like a thousand birds. I don't know if you can hear them. I'm afraid the microphone might be picking them up. Another one of those abandoned mall fountains. Does anyone go to malls anymore? Or are the malls pretty much dying all over the country? I wonder how many levels there are to this stronghold. What's in here? Nothing. I hear a spider, but I don't see a spider. One empty room after another. Is that all there is to this stronghold? Just a bunch of empty rooms, a bunch of empty cages. Maybe I just should start mining and see, to, see what I can take away from this place. I want all of those books that we saw in that library, but I'm not sure how I can transport all of those unless I come back with a with an empty inventory. It's dark behind that door. Bye.
spiral staircase. Let's see if there's some no good going on at the bottom of the staircase. Yeah, yeah, there's one of them right now. He's down there probably doing some kind of drugs or something. Dispatched. Maybe he was guarding this door. Maybe there's something behind here he doesn't want me to see. Or he didn't want me to see. Yeah. There's a big spider right there. Well, quite frankly, I think I'm about ready to uh, to get out of here. It looks pretty pretty boring. Just one empty room after another. I think the library was the most interesting part of this entire ordeal. Perhaps we have seen everything there is to see. Yeah, I've already looked in that. The one thing's for sure, I'd I've built up quite a collection of iron doors. I 
Oh my god, look at that. I got a weird feeling about this one. Right when you think it's all over, you discover more. Down, down, down we go. Ooh, chest. Two chests. Bread in a saddle. I can use the bread. How do we get over to the other side? need to get over there. Enchantment book. Enchanted book. All right, I've been through here. Get this coal just in case I need to make some torches.
there. Where are we? Okay, we're back close to the beginning again. Just I wonder how many of you are still watching this. If you are still watching this, the secret phrase is egg salad sandwich. So use it in the comments and I'll know that you watched at least an hour and 18 minutes worth a video. Egg salad sandwich. And I'm kind of hungry right now. Egg salad sandwich. Yeah, those silverfish are living in a lot of these blocks. here yet. Here comes one of the locals. We found a spawner.
we're going to go in there as soon as we make sure that we're not going to be jumped from behind. Let's go back and find that spotter. Which way? There it is. Steady. Be careful. this what is this look at the bars on the windows what a crazy room are those things? And that must be a silverfish spawner. These are. And we almost left this place thinking we'd seen it all. windows or the bars. I feel like I'm in Alcatraz prison. Let's just bust up some of these things. like obsidian. Can I even break one? I don't think I can. Possible. 
Let's go up from the top. Spawner gone. So tell me, what are these green and yellow things? It cannot be broken. Very, very strange. What's out here? I'm being shot at. This might be a good point to end this video. I'm gonna try to figure out how to get the books out of, out of this place. And there's going to be more of the lava camp mine shaft to, uh, to show you. I'm probably not going to leave this, this area until I have filled up that chest with, with uh, iron and gold and diamonds. And I would like to find a few, a few emeralds. And I appreciate you guys taking this little journey with me. And I hope you've enjoyed it. And remember the secret phrase. What was it? An arrow. The secret phrase is egg salad sandwich so you're probably asleep by now but if you're not if you're still awake until next time bye bye